All right, my lovelies. This is my post-market wrap-up still on this Monday, June 24th, 2019. All right, let's start off with the basics. Uh, this market, for the most part, did nothing today. Uh, stuck in a range. However, if you were to look at the, if you were to look at the Russell 2000, the small caps, that is companies based here in the United States, uh, they, they got walloped, falling over 1%. Again, our economy here in the United States is in free fall. Um, the Fed has got to step in, and they will. Come July, they're going to fire a bazooka on this market. 50 basis point cut. Uh, it's a lock, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, and I have a lot writing on this. I have, sincerely, my nearly flawless... Uh, reputation with regard to calling the Federal Reserve so uh, I'm going a little bit on a limb here but I think it's a certainty now why what's going on with this market today uh, why did we not do anything well it, it, it's this we, we have a waiting game on our hands we have tomorrow we're going to hear from actually Jay Powell is going to speak tomorrow and let's see what this guy does um, markets waiting on him and then of course we we have the G20 uh, let's see what comes out of that again th this debt market did you see the debt market today remember I explained to you if you're watching the bond yields a lot of cash going into the debt market today pushing rates even lower markets still saying no deal with China uh, that's just it's just not gonna happen this week and, and, and we might hear about how perfect it's going or beautiful or stupendous just to prop up the market. It's not going to be true. It will be yet another lie. Uh, and I don't know about you, but I've, I've, I frankly had, frankly had enough of it. It's just too much. Um, so what else are we hearing? Well, the earnings recession. Don't you love how they put these things? Earnings recession. Yeah. It's not that our economy is in recession. We're having an earnings recession, and that will or has the potential to push stocks higher. Yeah, you heard you heard that right. An earnings recession has the potential to push stocks higher because the Fed, yes, is not just the lender of last resort, but they are the buyers of last resort. Just like every other world central bank who is about to go nuclear. Period. The freaking end. Look. This is a comedy show we're, we're, we're watching here. Nothing is real. <laughs> it's, it's just like, okay, um, let's just play along. Let's all pretend. Let's pretend. Yeah, yeah, pretend. That's what, what we have. It's, it's, it's incredible. There's no difference between what's going on here in the markets and like a, a child playing a pretend game. Did you hear President Trump today saying that the Federal Reserve is like a child um, because they don't want to lower rates? Well, Mr. President, if our economy was really doing so strong and great, like you say it is, well, we would need to be cutting a damn thing now, would we? You remember how you were speaking during the campaign when you were a different guy, Mr. President, and you were explaining how the Fed was artificially suppressing rates to make Obama look good? What happened to that? Yeah, you forgot about that, didn't you? Oh, yeah. Oh, how about this one? Did you hear about Home Depot? Home Depot has said, oh, well, we're not going to be, pa well, they're going to try, okay? They're going to try to not be passing on to you and I the cost of goods because you know, the tariffs are going to cause these prices to rise. But wait a minute. I thought that the president said that China's paying the tariffs and we're taking in billions. There's another lie for you. Yeah, yeah, I am picking on the president today a little bit. Uh, and I wouldn't be picking on anyone, any other imbecile sitting in that pretty White House who's lying through their teeth to the highest order and can't stop themselves. Incredible. Uh, maybe they need to up their medication. It's the truth. All right, look, um, th that's it. So, look, again, it's all about the freaking debt market. You saw what happened today. I, I explained it to you in my first video. Yep. Cash through moving into the debt market here. All kinds of uncertainty. It's a freaking waiting game. You've got the freak show tomorrow, and you're going to hear from it, 
it is Jay Powell, in case you forgot. And then we got the other massive freak show, the the G20. Uh, what are they supposed to be? All rulers or something? Yeah, okay. I don't, uh, you can't make this stuff up. But it's but that's what they think they are. They think they're like our gods or something. Anyway, look. With that said, uh, we we you and I we're gonna reconvene tomorrow. Uh, and if you want to see what this bond market action look like today, just to get a visual, there is a link in the description of this video. It'll take you right to my lovely website, right side of the page, bond market. Go have a look at that uh, and uh, have some fun. See you tomorrow. I'm out of here.